Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to wrap up my 2022 favorites. So this is going to be mostly home and clothing favorites. If you missed my other video where I was talking about all my beauty favorites including makeup, skincare, and hair care, uh, be sure to check that out. I'll have it linked below in the description box. But without further ado, let's get started. So my first favorite from 2022 is a clothing favorite and it's a brand overall. So this is the Aloe Yoga brand. It's an athleisure brand, uh, similar in price point to like Lululemon, but they run sales pretty frequently. So I highly recommend uh, signing up for their mailing list and you can usually get like 30% off of their uh, clothing pieces. Um, like they did 30% off for Black Friday on everything, which was a very good deal. So I always buy mine on sale, but over the past year, I've bought so much from the brand and I love everything I've picked up. So first being this jacket, uh, this is the Foxy Sherpa jacket. It's kind of got this, um, teddy bear fabric here, but on the inside is a super soft knit, uh, very comfortable. It kind of has like a bomber jacket style and comes with a hood as well and the hood is detachable so super warm um i've worn this a lot this winter so far the other line from them they they have different materials for leggings and shirts and whatnot and i really like their aloe soft it's a super soft material they make leggings out of it uh t-shirts um long sleeve short sleeve etc and so I've got some collecting some pieces from that line. So the first uh, introduction for me was their Aloe Soft Lounge Leggings. These are kind of a high-waisted legging. They come up to me just below my belly button and they fit really well. So they kind of have this ribbed texture around the waistband and on the back it's kind of seamed so it follows the curve of your butt. It makes your butt look really good. And then the ribbed texture is also at the bottom here around the ankles. But overall, it's a really soft texture. And the thing I love about aloe leggings is that they are incredibly stretchy and they uh, like hold you in. They, they make you look really fit, but it's not constricting in any way. The material is like a four-way stretch. So um, all way so you're really not constricted any movement and you don't feel like you can't breathe like some cheaper leggings I've bought have that feeling these are not that at all so overall just a basic set of leggings but really comfortable I have these in several colors um, this is the dark gray heather I have pink heather uh, black as well and just a really good basic legging uh, that you can dress up or just down. The other um, pieces I have in this aloe soft material is just a basic white t-shirt. I have black as well. They make this in like, it's a crew neck short sleeve. They make this in uh, short sleeve and long sleeve as well. And so I've gathered some of these. So I love a white t-shirt with any legging and uh, if you've if you wear white t-shirts you know it can be hard to keep clean this is surprisingly extremely easy to clean and when you wash it it comes out looking brand new so uh for instance this past summer i was doing a lot of I, well i was wearing this and then i decided to do yard work after i'd come back from running some errands and was not paying attention to the fact that i was wearing my really nice <laughs> athleisure and especially white and I was taking out some weeds that had berries on it, like dark blue, purple berries. And anyways, I, it got all over this t-shirt and I was so scared that I had ruined it, but I used Zep, which my mom had told me about, and it came right out of this material as soon as I um, put that on it and then washed it, you know, in the washing machine, it came out looking as you can see, brand new. So highly recommend that for your uh, white t-shirts, but also this Aloe Soft material is really easy to keep clean. So, um, and I have other stuff from them as well, but mainly that Aloe Soft 
material and the lounge leggings and their basic um, t-shirts is really good. All right, so the other clothing favorite I have from this year is from Skin. So it's a brand called Skin and they sell it uh, several different higher end department stores like Bloomingdale's, I think Neiman Marcus sells it and skinworldwide.com is their website. And they base themselves on, or they pride themselves on being cotton only and a lot of Pima cotton as well. So they specialize in a lot of the basics um, from loungewear to sweaters to you know basic t-shirts, joggers, and then undergarments. And I was introduced to them through this bra and I love it. So um, during the pandemic, I don't really like to wear padded bras anymore and especially not push-ups and also I'm getting really particular about the materials of my clothing as well I want to go all natural with cotton as much as possible and this bra is phenomenal so uh, it has this deep V uh, cut out here but other than that there is no structure to it at all there's it's unlined um, or unpadded I should say it's got a thick uh, waist thick um, chest band and um, a thicker uh, clasp here. And it's the thing I like about it is the material is, if I can find the tag, 90% organic Pima cotton with 10% spandex. So it's super soft, very comfortable, uh, feels like you're wearing nothing, and I'm a convert. So I've got this in a couple colors now. The other style I picked up is this one. This doesn't have a clasp. It's kind of similar. It's just a traditional V neck, but it doesn't have the clasp as you have to pull it on. And this was their citrus color. They were in sales too occasionally, but uh, not as frequently as you, know, you might be used to with other brands. But this one is a similar construction. The only thing I don't like about this, number one, is that you it's a pull-on, but also the band on this one is like a stretchy band. It's not wrapped in the Pima cotton uh, fabric that the other one I just showed you is. So, But overall, I do really like this one. This one fits well, and I size up to a medium just so it's not as tight on me. And I have bought some other... Uh, pieces from them as well since I, I knew I liked the bras and was looking more into the brand. They make a lot of sweaters as I mentioned. This is one an oversized sweater that I picked up. They do these really kind of muted colors. This is like a muted kind of peachy skin tone color and really soft so let me see if I can find the blend on it for the fabric composition. So this is 95% cotton and 5% cashmere, and it is really soft. Uh, I've been wearing this one a lot as well for this winter. So I highly recommend anything from them. If you live in the States, be sure to check out like TJ Maxx and Marshalls. That's actually where I bought this blue bra from. And, uh, you know, it was a little pricey even there. Their, their line is kind of you pay for higher quality so be aware of that um, but you can sometimes find selected things on TJ Maxx and Marshall's websites. Alright so that's all of the clothing favorites I have. The next category I want to talk about is cleaning products and I discovered steam cleaning this year. I know I'm probably the last human on earth to discover steam mops and steam cleaning but I'm a total convert now. So anyways, this is the first product I want to mention. So this is the B the Bissell Steam Power Fresh Deluxe Steam Mop. So as you can see, it's just a simple uh, push mop. Target had these on sale around Black Friday for like $80. And I think regularly they're around $100. But this one is so good. So it comes with a little cup that you use to fill the canister you want to use distilled water only. But it has this really large mop head. As you can see, I've got the fabric cloths off. They're being washed right now. But it comes with two different types. There's a soft cloth, 
like for everyday cleaning and then there's one that kind of has scrubby bristles um, more of a little uh, harder texture to the cloth and that you know you could use to really scrub the floor the other thing is that you press this button here and you have a it lifts it lifts off and has the scrub brush so then it lifts off and you have these scrub bristles so you can see mine are dirty because I've been cleaning the grout so this is really good to clean the grout um, or any like hard if you had like a super sticky mess or something you know you could use this to scrub but I really like it it's very simple one of the simpler you know it doesn't have like spinning heads or whatnot like some of the others but I think that might be a downfall with them because this one has really good reviews it's simple it does its job well uh, and you have two different steam levels so you have the higher steam level you know that has more steam and then a lower steam level and yeah really simple I love it the the other place you can use this is on your shower glass doors so you can see I've got a medium-sized uh, shower glass shower and I hate cleaning it getting all the soap scum off it's really hard even you know after I get it clean I'm like okay I'm gonna use the squeegee every single time and inevitably I stop and get lazy and don't normally I spend like at least an hour scrubbing that thing it, it takes so much uh, so much manual scrubbing involved and chemicals you know as well with this I was like oh let me try using that in the shower this cleaned it in like seconds I'm not even joking you so uh, all I do I wish this handle came off honestly or you know retracted down so that it was more of a handheld for cleaning that shower but you just go to town and this this brush does a really good job at cleaning it so it made cleaning the shower such an easy task so I highly recommend it for that and your floors So after I was like, oh my gosh, what, if, you know, I need everything steam cleaned. I was looking into the Bissell brand and what other steam products they offer. And this is their steam shot. Actually, let me turn it around. This is the Bissell steam shot deluxe. And it comes it's kind of like your normal steamers, but it has all these attachments for any kind of job. So make sure if you are going to buy this that you get the deluxe version that comes with all of these attachments but it's got a super long cord you just again use uh distilled water and this hose comes off so you can use it directly your attachments directly on the this thing but you don't want to be tilting it all different directions because the hot water would you know come out so i like having the cord because then i can really scrub the stove top or the um, the hood over the stove. Um, so the Steam Shot Deluxe model comes with a bunch of different attachments. So one being a fabric steamer attachment. So it comes with this, it's honestly like a rough cloth, but it has elastic all the way around. And so you can steam your, you know, clothes that you normally would if you don't already have a fabric steamer. And then this, that the cloth was just around, it hooks into can get this it hooks into this tool which is a uh, window squeegee so this can clean windows shower glass doors and so the steam comes out of these openings and then you're able to wipe the water with the squeegee the other nice tools that it comes with are these scrub brushes so it comes with three and they're all color coordinated are color coded so you have a black one a red one and then there's also a green one I have that one in my kitchen but this is basically so you, you're not mixing and matching like the bathroom uh, brush with your kitchen brush and then so yeah you have three different ones to choose from the other one it comes with is the scraper tool so I tried using this in the oven I don't have a super dirty oven but 
I also was using it in like one of my aluminum baking pans that has a bunch of just cooking marks from over the years. It didn't really work that well on that to be honest but if you had like sticky messes or something on the floor or the other uh, use for this is to get up stickers from you know different objects um, supposedly steam works really well or even for wallpaper and then it also comes with a grout brush I was just noticing my dog looks like she he has gotten a hold of this so hopefully it still fits on the end of the nozzle if not I'll have to get another one I guess or just use the uh, scrub brush on the power fresh steam mop but has this and these bristles are like really hard so they're really going to scrub into the grout and get it really clean so I believe that is all of the attachments unless I've misplaced some but I think that's everything but yeah I am I love steam cleaning now it makes cleaning such an easy task and a fast task at that and um highly recommend it I do want to link a picture so I was in TJ Maxx last weekend and they had one at a random kind of entering into the home section and it was kind of on the floor in a corner and I will insert a picture of it so after I had bought these the steam sh shot or sorry the steam shot and the power fresh I discovered that they make a steam mop that basically is a handheld that turns into it basically combines the steam shot and the power fresh steam mop so if you don't have e either one of these products and you're interested in the uses for both look into that model um, it's a little bit more expensive full price like if you get it at target i think it's around 160 but tj maxx had one brand new in box and it was only 79.99 so right at 80 dollars and you basically get both products in one so i recommend you know going to your home goods marshall's tj maxx if you're interested in steam cleaning and want to get a tool um, maybe look into that one because it combines both the steam mop and the steam cleaning tools all right so those are my favorite uh home products from 2022 i really wanted to feature the brands that i've really fallen in love with this year and have really made my life better both in you know keeping my house clean and then also making me feel good you know in the clothes that I choose to wear so I hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure to like and subscribe and I want to hear what your 2022 favorites are if you have beauty favorites if you have home favorites uh, cleaning favorites clothes favorites whatever it is I want to hear what that is in the comments down below and I hope you will consider liking and subscribing and I will see you in my next video bye